Hi there, my name is Aaron Short and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you three accessories that I've found for the Boss Waza Air. So I hope you're enjoying your Waza Air if you have them, and I hope you're going to get some if not, because they really are excellent. I'm using them all the time. I wanted to get some accessories to use with them, so I thought I'd share what I got here, because I was searching on Amazon for quite a while. Uh, the first thing is a cable. This is a headphone extension cable. Now it took me a long time to find this, and the reason is that it's not very long. And you know, who's gonna buy a headphone extension cable that long? Not many people. So I found this one, I'll put links below to what, where you can buy these accessories. And please subscribe to my channel. But yeah, there's two reasons you'd want this. The first reason is that certain guitars either have an active pickup that generates noise from them, or the jack doesn't fit this connector at all, okay? If that's you, then you need this cable. All it does is you plug this one into here, and then this has the same connector as this one here, so it just gives you that standard jack, basically, for your guitar. The other reason is some acoustic guitars, electric guitars, have active pickups, some basses too have active pickups, and if you put this in the guitar, this is so close to those electronics that you can get a lot of noise, high-pitched whining, that kind of stuff. So again, using this, you can plug this in and you get this distance, that distance eliminates that noise most of the time, at least with all the guitars I've tried it with. It eliminates that noise. So really useful cable. The other reason you might want this cable is if you don't want to use the built-in sounds of the headphones, say you own a Kemper or a Helix or a pedal board or a mixer that's sending sound out of that, say you want to use it with that. Well, what I've found is that this works absolutely fine with the Helix products I have, but it doesn't work with the Kemper or my mixer, I get a lot of noise again. So again, you need to get this away from those electronics that are in those pedals. So same thing again, you plug into this, you plug this into the pedal, and it will give you that distance that you need to eliminate that noise. So a few reasons to have this, you may not need it, but I would suggest you have one anyway, and if you're gonna plug it into specialist guitars or pedals, you definitely wanna have it. Okay, the second accessory is, again, for that. This is just a little lightweight um, neoprene pouch. So the reason I got this is, if I'm using it on my acoustic, I, I need to obviously hold it in something. So again, I would plug this into here, plug this into the guitar, then this goes into the pouch, it locks down with Velcro on top, and this just goes onto your strap. So this is in the guitar, and this is on your strap just to hold it while you're playing. Very lightweight, um, very functional, very useful. Useful for other wireless systems too. Very cool little pouch. So there's that, basically the whole thing there. And then to protect your investment, I mean, these things are not cheap, right? I wanted a nice case. I was hoping that Boss would release a case. They haven't yet, but I wanted something protective if I take these on the road with me and even at home. So I shopped around to find one of these kind of half size cases because I find that they fit perfectly in here. And even this one, you know, it's, it's kind of bulky, right? I didn't want anything any bigger than that. You can get bigger ones, of course, but I like this one because it's not too bulky. So what I do, personally, is I fold them in like this. So one is resting on the other, put them in all the way. And then just put them in with the shape uh, matching basically and there is a pocket here for some accessories but these are already kind of sticking out a bit I don't want to press down on there too much so I've been putting the transmitter just inside here like that carefully and then close it down on top fits perfectly look at that really really nice very smart very cool very protective too I mean these things aren't cheap right so protect your investment so three accessories there you may need, you may not need, but I wanted to put them on video anyway. Once again, please subscribe to the channel. More videos coming very soon. If you've found any cool accessories for your Waza Air headphones, please put them in the comments below. If you need to buy some of these, please let me know if this video was useful. Like, are you using these standalone? Or are you using them with your Kemper, your Helix, or your pedal board? How are you using them? Are you using them with acoustic? Are you using them for bass? Are you using them for keyboards? Let me know, share it in the comments below. Do subscribe to the channel. I'll put these Amazon links below for you to order these if you need them. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.